Welcome to the video. Today we're talking about the performance improvements in the DirectX Vulkan 64-bit version of TF2. This is a beta in Steam. It's available right now. If you can see this, you see Linux test. This also works on Windows. Now, I have done a test on the Shonex 100 player server, which you are looking at right now. And after compiling all the data and benchmarking this one demo, we have this. So, on the 64-bit, using DXVK with Vulkan, we have an average of 78, almost 79 frames per second on TF2. This is the same demo, the same benchmark, the average is 75 frames per second. Not only that, the frame times are way better. Um, heck, even the 64-bit without Vulkan is better optimized. And hopefully, along with these optimizations, Will come a lot of other stuff like maybe an increased entity limit which should allow 100 player servers to run better Small stuff like that more fps is always better right other people have gotten different uh, fps improvements someone's gotten like 13 percent fps improvements someone's gotten 21 percent fps improvements i think it varies considering i was on the show 100 player server there is a very large uh, it, it, there's a very large load on the CPU that TF2 is using. Alright, that's it.